Hello, my name is Peter and I'm the pastor here at Jacksonburg United Methodist Church in the loveliest part of Ohio, if you ask me. I'm really, truly excited to bring you a little bit of a foretaste of a campaign that we're going to embark on for the next six weeks. Now, I want to preclude this by explaining when I say campaign, I'm not just asking for money. Well, really, when you think about it, we ask for money every week, so that should be no different. But that's not what we're focusing on as we engage in a series called Focus Transform. We are going to take our focus and we're going to put it on our mission as Methodists, as believers, as people of faith uh, who walk in a world that needs good news. And that focus is our mission, our mission to make disciples of Jesus Christ for the transformation of the world. That's a mission that was given to us by Jesus. We've sort of codified it as our personal mission statement for the Methodist Church. And really, it's my life mission, and I think yours as well. Our focus on the mission leads us to the concept of transforming ourselves and transforming our world. We believe that we do that together as a community of faith. So we're going to examine something that has been called the five practices of a fruitful congregation and how they engage with us individually and what they mean to our personal lives as well as our corporate life. These are things like radical hospitality, passionate worship, intentional faith development, risk-taking mission and service, and extravagant generosity. If you took your Bible and you opened it up to the book of Acts, and you went to the last six verses of the second chapter, you will see the kind of church that I bet you would love to be a part of, and I know I would love to pastor, described in just six verses. I'm not going to read it to you now. I'll wait for the weekend to do that, because I've got some surprises in store in that passage. But I will tell you this. I am already pastoring a church that looks like that church in Acts. I'm very proud and pleased to say that. And if you are part of Jacksonburg Church, you're already part of a church that looks like that. But how can we do a little better? I believe there's some folks in our congregation that have been given unique gifts, unique abilities, unique talents, and we're all different enough that we all bring something to the table that can make a difference, and we're gonna get better at doing that. So here's my challenge to you. Over the next six weeks, we're heading into summer. Chances are, you're not gonna be in church every week. And I understand that. However, I want you to fully engage with this series. So I'm gonna actually make videos kind of just like this, where I'm talking directly to you for every sermon in this series, in addition to our regular live stream. And we're gonna have some exercises at the end of it where we actually look at what it is that we've been made to do and how can we turn this into something that brings us closer into the community. I have really good news for you. Getting more involved and getting uh, better at using our time and our talent and our treasure in the service of the gospel will do nothing but make your life better. If you're doing that now, that's fantastic. If you wanna do it a little bit better, we're gonna explore how to do this together. I invite you on this journey to focus, to transform, and for us to become the church of God and the people of God that we were made to be. Thank you. I will see you Sunday, or you will see me this way. God bless you.